Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Blue. What the heck? This isn't Pokemon Blue. Final Fantasy. I don't know why I have Pokemon on the head. On my mind. Yeah, this is Final Fantasy. Uh, I bought some new stuff. <laughs> uh, some new spells. Life is going to be helpful. Uh, uh, Faragans, Lora. Faragans will be nice. Alright, so here we are. Uh, at the Giant's Cave. Okay. What am I looking at? Cockatrice? Maybe I encountered a cockatrice off screen. I don't know, dude. Oh, it's been a while since I recorded this episode. So it's been I don't I don't I don't remember everything. <laughs> yeah. Uh you got the you got Starly for meeting the vampire. So you come up here, give it to him, we'll let you buy. And yeah, I mean, you'll see, but yeah. Bye. And you do have to sit there and wait for him to move very slowly off screen. Isn't it great? Isn't it fantastic? Yeah, bye. See you, dude. City's cave. I feel like it is. Alright. I don't think there's there's nothing up there. Let's just talk to the sage and get out of here, man. Where is he at? There he is. Sada? Okay. Bye. Yay, Earth Rod. Alright, so we're going back to uh, Earth Cavern, or whatever the heck it's called. Probably meet you right where I beat the vampire. Yep. I thought I would. Cavern of Earth, that's what it's called. Alright, good to know. These are the uh, annoying guys that can shoot like needles out of them and poison you, I think. It's either that or one of the cousins you fight later on. Well, he dies all the same, anyway, so. Money, money, money. <laughs> encounter, encounter, encounter. A dead end. That's another dead end. More encounters, you know. Oh, I hate the cockatrices. Now in the flesh. Cockatrices can uh, stone you, which is annoying. You know, it's basically. It's kind of like it's like it's like death, but not death. <laughs> it's like semi death. I uh, probably overkill. Oh well, he's dead. Cacatrices can be kind of annoying, especially in really large groups. Three of them is whatever. Mm -hmm. da -da 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 -da. All right, more treasure. 
Yeah, like that. See, I'm like freaking out. I was like, where are my gold needles? Because if uh, you know, I had no gold needles, I would have to leave. Thankfully, I did have them. Uh, Mithril Shield. That's a bit better. I'm gonna heal up. Yeah. Yeah. Kevin and Ruth, five. Basement, five, I guess. Hmm. I think I'm going the right way, actually. Oh. <laughs> Dead end. I didn't get an encounter with that entire time. Alright, we better heal up. There's uh, something big beyond that door. Yeah. Something big. Something's still pretty easy, but size wise, it is pretty big. Always keep multiple saves, especially if you are recording stuff. You never know if something bad's gonna happen. Hmm, the first fiend. Finally made it to the very first fiend. Fiend of Earth, Lich. He's pretty easy. He can cast, yeah, he can cast some spells. I think they hit decently hard. If you don't have the right nulls up. I think this is really the first fight that... But temper, do we have haste? Yeah, we have haste. Temper and haste are, like, actually gonna be good. And helpful. Another example of a heal coming in handy. At first I wasn't really a big fan of heal when I first played this game, but it's it definitely comes in handy here and there. I don't think this hits. Does it? Okay, no. I couldn't remember. <laughs> no frost. I don't know if I show it off, but Lich is also weak to fire. I don't know if he... He might have a thunder spell. I'm not sure. I better be safe than sorry, yo. Peace. Haste. All haste does is, like, if you attack, it gives you more attacks. Like, I think it doubles your attacks. Like, physical attacks. Like, you know, like when I, you know, when you do a physical, a physical attack, it says eight hits. I would hit. say I already did eight hits. When I cast haste, I would do 16 hits. Bye. I guess I did show off his weakness to fire. With Faraga, I think. Bye. Easy peasy. Not too bad. Spells, definitely the worst part of them. But I didn't have many spells that he really cast. That, like, the first one was like the dang most dangerous one. And hey, look, we finally, uh, filled in, what, brought, 
what what are we doing with the crystals? Bringing light back to them. We finally brought light to the first one. Hey, yay! Like the yellow, orangish one. Brown, kind of. Brownish or yellow. Uh, I also get to see our uh, first optional dungeon in the game. My favorite. I absolutely love them. And by that, I mean I hate them. I'm not a big fan of the optional dungeons in this game. They're just tedious, long, tedious. Alright, so we're back here. Where are we going? <laughs> I seriously don't remember. What is after? Oh, duh. Can't believe I forgot. I got poisoned. It's always funny when it does a sudden cut and I'm in the menu and somebody's poisoned. <laughs> New enemies. Bugs. Big bugs. Nothing's to get too bad. These guys are pretty easy. Hey, Inkeg? Onkeg? Oh, hey, look, we're poisoned again. Just kill him. There you go. Yay! Oh, that didn't actually didn't kill him. Hmm. Hmm. Bye. Goodbye. Sayonara. Gotta kill poison again. Right, can I get there without another encounter? The answer's no. Almost there. Almost there. There we go. Let's uh, rest up. Pleasant dreams. Fast forward. Because nobody cares. Because I don't care. Alright. What items you got? Do we have enough? Is this when I do it? No, I just buy 20. You'll see. I'll do what I was thinking I might have done eventually. Hmm. Why is the magic here? Pratera's good. All the other ones. That's Stona. Stona and Pratera. Whenever I get the magic levels for it. So, black magic. The dog is good. Wakes. Uh, death is. Uh. I'd rather have those than stun. Uh, what about the equipment? Mr. Sword. Oh, decent upgrade. Alrighty. He's asleep. Standing up. Walking in place. Good job. Wish I could do that. There you go. Going between the buildings. Talk to these losers over here. Sages, eh? The black power of the crystals. Yes. Yes. Brilliant. Four hundred years ago, honey. Hey. Cast play. Ah, okay. 
I will definitely come back here. I promise. If I remember. Take the canoe. Or face the fire fiend. The canoe lets us get in the shallow water. Like the lighter. Like the lighter water. The light blue water, basically. Be able to go through that. It'd be really handy. Handy dandy. I show it off. Yeah, you know, like that. It's really good. Really handy. Oh wow, I go there? I really go there with no encounters? There's no way. There's no way. It's really happening. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. What are the chances of this game with the most ridiculous encounter I ever letting me get to my next area without an encounter? What the heck? It's a miracle. Alright, wow. We made it. That's our next... That's where we want to go. Mount Doug. <laughs> well, that's where the next fiend is at. And, yeah, so... Uh, until then, guys. I'll uh, see ya.